All right, all right, all right. We're here with another Mixin' with Nixon, and this time I got my first guest, Jimmy Diamond. Yo! How the hell are you, my friend? I'm doing well. Yourself? Hey, I got no complaints. I'm made in the shade with Kool-Aid, and I'm just glad that you're here. Hey, how about a mojito? Hey, sounds good. We're going to do a strawberry mojito today, folks. Shout out to Teresa for the suggestion. I'm excited to get to it. So, we're going to start off with our mint, and I'm just going to grab a handful of it here. I'm going to get like four good leaves, smack it a couple times, help release that aroma. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to muddle the mints, but not like overkill it, just kind of bruise it so that flavor and that smell starts to pop out. Mm, you can smell it. Oh yeah. Smells good. Perfect. So the next thing we're going to do is add our ice. Just throw that in there. And then we're going to get our white rum. I just chose Bacardi because it's simple, easy, and smooth. And Ever visit the, the uh, distillery of Puerto Rico? No. San Juan, Puerto Rico. Get all the you Bacardi been? you want. You've been there? A couple of times. I, I think I'm banned. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? So you're going to need four ounces or two ounces per drink. So that's going to be about two shots and a half. There we go. Next up is the lime juice. And again, if it's one drink, it's three, four, seven ounce. But since I'm making two, one shot glass is going to get the job done. Pour it in. And then the next thing up, the last liquid, is going to be your simple syrup. Again, three-fourths ounce per drink. By the way, there are recipes for simple syrup if you want to, if you, if you can't yeah. find it at your liquor store. This is easier than making it. Oh, yeah. And then what I just did for us was I diced up some fresh strawberries. Uh -oh. We're going to pop those babies in here. Not all of them. That seems like a fair amount. And then I'm going to go ahead and get ready to shake it up. Whoa. Working out at the gym. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Every day's arm day. <laughs> All right. Look at that. Let that all frosty. Perfect. And we're going to go ahead and start pouring it. Uh, experience. Got to make sure we're even, Steven. Top it off with. Yep. I'm gonna to top it off with just a little bit of soda water. You gonna be my stir for hey, me? Hey man, I, I stir things up all the time. Yeah, you do. That's what the wife says. Keep stirring things up. Ooh, stir. these look pretty good. Stir, stir, stir. Stir, stir, stir. You ever get hit with one of those as a kid? By the nuns. <laughs> my parents used to always get, they would always say, I'm getting the wooden spoon and I, I would be terrified. Look out, look out. All right. Salute. Cheers. Whew. Dang. Good? That's a darn good cocktail there, Mr. Nixon. Taste the mint. Can even smell it. The strawberries was a nice touch. I appreciate that suggestion from you, Teresa. And yeah, I've never actually even made one of these until today. So you could, you could probably use peaches. Oh, you could probably use any pineapple, fruit. blackberry, blackberry, mango. Sure. So that is the strawberry mojito for you folks. Another mixin with Nixon. Anything you'd like to say before we close it out? Dang good drink. Try it. Stay beautiful, America. I love you guys. Have a good one. Bye.